Okay, first mistake, besides leaving an hour and a half late. Do not leave during commute traffic. This is <laughs> this is 680 South at a little after 9, about, uh, I don't know, 915 or so. Um, people, for the most part, seem to be uh, respectful enough of what we're driving and how big it is, so it's not really that bad getting merging over and getting into the right lanes and stuff, but as you can see, it's even though I'm in the right, correct lane, it's uh, pretty slow moving here. We're about, uh, let's say, 13 miles to go to get to the 580 junction to where we head down a different direction across towards Tracy, etc., to get on the southern route down towards the LA area. Hopefully the traffic won't be this bad when we get to 580 in about 15, 20 minutes. And this is what somebody who's not driving gets to do. Relaxing. Well, yeah, we can tell. And so is Maddie. <laughs> Maddie's grooving. And then Linda's got her feet propped up. She's feeling good. And the other dogs are in the back sleeping. Well, here we are trying to climb the hills over, over Bakersfield, or out of Bakersfield, I should say. We're going along there pretty good. And all of a sudden, right here at the peak, everybody's stopping. You can see how slow we're going. Shouldn't complain though, the weather's been good. We've been traveling a pretty good clip. Dogs are fine. Okay, remember the hill we were trying to go up? We're almost to the peak. The peak's probably not less than a mile, three quarters of a mile maybe, just ahead of what you're looking at. Bad news is something broke, a line or whatever, and we're leaking transmission fluid all over the ground. Without the transmission fluid, obviously, we no move. So we've called uh, roadside service, which will take them hours to find us. And then they're gonna tow us over this hill and down the hill to, I guess, a place maybe 10 miles up the road that works on RVs. Bad news about that is, this is so late in the afternoon that uh, they're probably gonna be closed by the time we get there. So we have to make some kind of arrangements to spend the night either in this rig or in a motel until the place opens up in the morning and uh, fixes whatever broke and leaked fluid all over the ground. So, it started out to be a nice trip. Right now we got a hiccup in the road, obviously. Uh, I'll get back to you when we find out what's going on. We're gonna wait here probably for hours for these guys to find us. This way to the phone back. Well, I'm back. My battery's kind of low. But I uh, wanted to document this. I missed the other one. This is our third mechanic shop in three states. This is becoming the RV adventure from hell as far as mechanics go. The sensor's in this thing because it sat so long. Uh, are just giving me mixed signals. It'll run good and going down the freeway, flying, and then when you stop it, it doesn't want to go smoothly anymore. And everybody says, you know, it's the sensors, it's the fuel pump, it's this. And we're limping our way across the United States. We're currently in Oklahoma. And uh, like I said, this is the third mechanic shop. And we're changing out, and this is what we're really hoping not to have to do. Dropping the fuel tank and putting in a new fuel pump. 
the forces inside the fuel tank. This is going to kill some more. Everything we stop and do, this is killing our scheduled time to get home by Thursday. This is Tuesday. And I'm going to be driving all night again like I did last night. I didn't get much sleep last night because I was stressing about this. Hopefully these guys will get this thing done by, I don't know, 4 or 5 o'clock this afternoon. And then I'm off to Amarillo for the next stop to stay in an RV park. If I can make it that far without falling asleep. But uh, there's been fun things about this. It's been great, but boy, stopping and thinking we got things done, you get on the road, something else will break. Driving is nuts. So it's a little shop called Chad's Automotive in uh, in Oklahoma. And when we leave here, we're heading for Amarillo for the night. So I'll keep you posted. Not having fun right now. <laughs>